but I also protect the fandom is probably going to be destroyed in 2019. That's what I'm predicting because, uh, people already hate this game more than I do. I believe the fandom is going to be destroyed in 2018 because, um, uh, just over time, because Fortnite isn't going to continue, like, they're not, they don't listen to the, the community, they don't listen to them. I believe back in, like, when they first started Fortnite back in 2017, people, they listen to people, because the community is small ever since, you know, Fortnite exploded in popularity. I don't think they, they don't care about people's opinions anymore. What are they going to add? They're going to add. Whatever idea they have, they're just going to add in there. It doesn't matter if it's going to ruin the game. It doesn't matter. That's what people are probably going to leave about. As long as you don't change the fundamentals of, uh, of building or shooting, they're just gonna keep on adding things that are just gonna annoy it, annoy the main purposes, like boom boxes, for example. I think it's gonna be a dark time for Fortnite. It's kind of already is, but it's gonna be a matter of time when we get up to like season 10. What's gonna happen in season 10? Oh, it's more, more crap. Same thing. It's gonna drive people crazy. It's gonna lead people to like a, a, a revolution. People are gonna storm into the Epic Games building, and they want more fun stuff, not not boring, you know, stuff. And people, people get, people are already bored of winning. They need something different that makes winning fun again. Our new strategies. So I predicted the future, kind of about Fortnite, because uh, that video was from earlier in this year, and I kind of predicted it. I mean, I was being very kind of vague, but. Uh, took some leaps of faith and decided, you know, you just go for it, and look what happened, I was kinda right. Kinda took what happened right there, in season 7, that's when I recorded it, I think, from that footage, and now, look where we are today, in season 10. Now that's right, season 10 just has more crap in it that, uh, people are gonna, uh, revolt against, and it's kinda happening, I was kinda right. And all we need to do is for people to storm the Epic Games office and my predictions are all fulfilled. But in all seriousness, um, this game is in a terrible state. Like, a lot of people are coming to my side now. I'm gonna, for many, see, for many, like, years since I played this game, I, I kind of had this opinion that Fortnite's crap, everything's unbalanced, everything's unfair, and it took the rest of the community, the rest of the community, until a giant robot to join, to get into the game for people to actually join my side, which is hilarious. Cause, imagine for Epic Games' stance, the equivalent of a tryhard is a, is a noob in a mech. That is the equivalent of a tryhard. Now I like that it was actually balanced, that would've been fair, but as I'm recording this, it is disabled. I don't know what that about, probably cause all the glitches are in it, because there's a lot of bugs that you get you a win, which I think they're finally taking care of, maybe, I don't know. Maybe if it's up in the game daily, stuff wouldn't break all the damn time, but that's just my opinion, because my opinion doesn't mean anything, it's not like, oh my god, but, I'm not getting too far from, I'm not, I'm not getting into my ass, my own ego here, I'm just gonna talk about the game in general, so, it's crap. It's been crap, people just haven't noticed it until season 10. That's the thing, I know so much stuff that's wrong with this game, yet no one, they get back and they're like, no, no Keith, you're wrong, you are wrong. All my friends are like, no, you're wrong, you're, you just suck, well they don't say I'm suck, they don't say I suck, they say that you're salty, that's what they say, <laughs> that's, that's what everyone else, you know, on online talks on me, they, they, everyone online says I suck, in, in some of my videos, oh they still, you're just bad at the game, get good, no, 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 now, now, you're, you're, you're with me now. You're on my side now, well screw you. <laughs> no, I'm kidding, I, I, I welcome everyone because I'm, I'm, I'm glorying, and, I'm bathing the glory, guys. Like, I was right. Jesus Christ, I'm right. I'm right, Jesus, I'm right. I'm finally right. For once. You know, it's nice, you know, I'm actually gonna get my ego all, all, you know, hyped up or anything, but, you, know, you gotta go to a point. Where I'm stuck in this one opinion, one opinion for this long. Anyone know? It, it finally came true. They they finally, Epic Games finally did it. I said in that video, as long as they don't mess up the core mechanics of the game, which are building in the shooting, which one, I wish they got rid of Bloom, that would be a good change to shooting, but they they screwed up with building. You can't remove turbo building, the tryhards. They're one thing, they're one thing that keeps them into this game, they're one thing is the building and if you remove it or change it or nerf it, they're all gonna rage, they're all gonna rage quitting on the Minecraft. 
That's why Minecraft's becoming popular again, because everyone's leaving it. You know? That they're all going Minecraft. Have a good time. So thank you. Thank you, Epic Games, for making Minecraft come back to life again. Well, I mean, it wasn't really dead, but, you know, it's, it's having a second resurgence. Like, it's kind of nice. It's kind of nice that it's happening again. All because you don't know how, you don't know how to handle your game. Whether it's some sort of experiment that you're doing at the games, I, I don't know. This isn't like a hate video that begins. I'm just like saying like I'm just responding to the community how they respond to type of games, and I'm just getting my own theories out there. I'm pretty sure Epic Games is trying to do some sort of experiment. They're probably gonna fix it all by the end of the season. Like, look, we messed up. I think they really messed up, but they're probably gonna fix it next season. Probably vault the mech. Probably I bet they're gonna vault the combat because <laughs> like, God forbid you haven't aimed the game for more than like two seasons. They introduced a couple seasons ago. God forbid, but you know, um, they're probably gonna vault combat, probably. Again, they're gonna vault the mech, for obvious reasons. A lot of people hate it, they're gonna remove it, like the boombox, planes, um, everything. Everything that, oh yeah, the, the sword, that's what I'm talking about. The sword, the plane, and the boombox, everyone hated it, all the triers hated it, so they removed it. But, uh, you know, I can't believe that this is happening in <laughs> the community. Like, I'm still gonna play the game, don't get me wrong, I mean, I, even though I hate the game, still, like, I, I'm beyond hatred, like, I want this game to die in a hole, but, I'm still gonna play it, because it's, it's addictive, and, um, seems a lot of other pros, they're like, they don't wanna delete the game, they don't wanna uninstall the game, they don't wanna stop playing, they wanna support it, but they can't if the developers are moving what makes the game fundamentally working, because this game's all unbalanced, you have shotguns that do 200 damage, you have all the... They added in boombos that do over 100 damage. You know, they, they just keep adding modes that don't work for the game. You know, I, I can firmly say that Team Rumble does not work in Fortnite. Even though I play it all the time, it just does not work. The fundamental coding of that game does not work for a team-based experience. Fortnite is about being a single person trying to win a game. If you have other people there, you, you can't emote when you lose. And that's something that I don't understand, but I finally understand now because the coding only allows the winning team to win. And the losing team can't, even if you are alive, because you respawn. So you may, you know, you know that in my you know newer videos, I don't really talk about the community in Fortnite all that much. Mostly because I wanted to save it for this video because um I don't see how everything plays out. Cause you have like like uh, Tifu who wants to leave the game with all these pros. They're all, they're all playing the tournaments and not and not the actual game itself, like, you're only playing Torment, 2020k or whatever, blah, 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 done. And I think a lot of pros said they're hyped about playing Minecraft after the tournament. I don't know when the tournament's gonna be, but I'm pretty sure Epic Games is gonna lose a lot of players. Probably lost millions already. Um, kind of amazing how you know anything. One, one thing that the game, everyone leaves. You know, it's not like, you know, it really shows how, like, Fortnite's just a fad, it's just a trend. Because, like, Minecraft, yeah, people left when 1.9 came out, but, you know, it's like, people still stayed. Even, like, Microsoft bought Minecraft, people just left. They were like, nope, nope. They didn't even, see, they didn't even give Microsoft a chance. Like, nope, it's, it's ran by a company, nope, we're done. Which is a, a, a weird statement for someone to leave over a company buying a game. Because it happens all the time. But I guess, because it's not ran by a single person anymore, it's not run by a company. But it, that's not my case, that's not my case. It's funny how just one thing that and everyone leaves. It's funny how that is. All the supporters that, that, that supported Epic Games, Fortnite, everyone that played the game, all the supporters, they're gone. Epic Games has like very little people anymore that of independent creators saying, oh, I like this game still. Because even Ninja, their, their mascot for this game doesn't like what they're doing anymore. And it's mind boggling how they do this, like, they should listen to Ninja, they probably will fix it, they probably know, they're not stupid, hopefully not, but, if Ninja says, up, oh, this game is, uh, what are you doing, Epic, they're gonna fix it, and, uh, hopefully soon, now, I'm not giving my hopes up in this season, maybe next month when season 11 comes out, next couple months, they're gonna fix it, they're gonna fix some stuff, but they're just gonna keep adding in more crap, like I said, in my 2019 prediction video for this game, they're just gonna keep adding crap and crap and crap because they don't understand the community. And uh, they're not because they don't play the game. Because I actually seen footage of like the developers playing the game back in like season two, I think. And um, they they played the game. They were 
I think Donald Mustard, I think his name was. I don't know their faces or names or what they look like. But I think one of them was talking about how like, you're gonna add stuff into Fortnite and how like there's like predictions for the mech back in season two. And it's like, my god. Like, no wonder that <laughs> Fortnite was just gonna fail. Cause all they needed, all they need, all these developers needed was big publicity. And that's when season three happened, all the, the, the Fortnite boom. Of everyone playing this game, it became a meme, millions of people played it, that's what they needed to, to end this game. So, it's because of us, in my opinion, that the game screwed over. Because they have all these ideas, so I'm pretty sure they couldn't add them in there because, you know, like, money problems, I guess. Like, like I bet in like five years' time, all this stuff would have been added in, like the mechs and all these locations. But because we kept playing and gave them all, like, all this money from buying all their stuff, we just kept feeding them money, which meant more stuff being put into development. Which means a lot more ideas are coming in. And they're, they're beyond scraping the barrel. I'm surprised they keep going with these ideas. It's just amazing what Fortnite has become now. It really is. So I'm going to end this video here. I don't know how long it's going to be. I just kind of rambled on for a bit. But if you guys have enjoyed this hit the like button and subscribe. Let's see if this video, video can get like 3 likes. I think that's a doable thing. I'm going to go now, so bye. Yeah, I confess, Father, I confess Cause I've been living wrong, I know I've been blessed I, I had a thousand chances